here's the thing, Bruce. I'm great at controlling my anger. Mm. I do it all the time. When I'm catcalled in the street, when incompetent men explain my own area of expertise to me, I do it pretty much every day because if I don't, I will get called emotional or difficult or might just literally get murdered. So I'm an expert at controlling my anger because I do it infinitely more than you. IMDB really thought they were doing something special when they tweeted this out. They were so happy. It was brave and it was stunning. But the reality of it is, it's been a glorious backfire. The tweet says, um, say it louder for the people in the back. Brave and stunning. Oh, we're so brave and we're so stunning. Except when you actually look at the comments, our good friend, Quarter Black Garrett, ratioed the hell out of this tweet. And it says, 2016 called. It wants its whiny feminist writing back. And that's something that so many of us have recognized with this series and not just this series but so many other series out there um and as a matter of fact there's viva right there there's melanie mack um but viva actually um has an interesting tweet about this now in this uh video that you watched at the beginning of my video she talks about all of these ridiculous statements pertaining to women and she says or i could literally just be killed well, Viva has something called facts. Now, I know a lot of people get triggered by facts, and it really upsets them, so trigger warning for the people that don't like facts. But the fact is, uh, fact check, 78% of homicide victims are male. Uh-oh, there goes your narrative. Uh-oh, facts once again enter the equation, and of course, they're very toxic. So Disney, Marvel, and the mainstream they continue to get owned and destroyed by facts and reality. And people, generally speaking, are sick and tired of all of this nonsense. So we'll continue to laugh at She-Hulk. We'll continue to roast it because it's a lot of fun. And there's a lot of stuff coming out this month that I think is going to be very roast worthy. And unfortunately, that's coming off of something that was good, though, because we don't have anything else good, it seems, outside of Cobra Kai, which I do think will be fantastic. Better Call Saul ended up being one of the best series I have seen in a long time and really did live up to the Breaking Bad legacy and i didn't think that was possible better call saul was a phenomenal series but now we have she hulk going on we have rings of power which is going to be an absolute trash fire beyond belief we have house of dragon which i'm not really sure what to expect out of that because of the game of thrones situation with season eight but it's going to be interesting to watch it play out we have andor the new star wars series which is going to have a trumpian world to focus on so a lot of trash fires out there, but you do have Cobra Kai Season 5, which I'm very much looking forward to. Also, we are now focusing heavily on our Locals community, where I just posted the new Geeks and Gamers hats over there. Um, those are going to be available for pre-order over on 221B. So if you have not checked out our store over on 221B, we have a lot of cool merch over there. There's the shirts, there's the patches, there's the bag. Um, there's a lot of cool stuff over there, but please follow us on Locals. We're going to be posting a lot of exclusive content on Locals. Looking forward to seeing all of you over there. Can't wait. And Locals is essentially a hybrid between Patreon and Facebook groups. So our supporters will be able to communicate directly with us. We're going to do more live streams. We're going to be able to communicate directly with you, give you specific updates. And we also have the premium membership on geesandgamers.com. But we are going to be slowly moving that premium membership over to Locals. And it's a better way for us to communicate with you, and it will give you more bang for your buck. But if you are not supporting us financially on Locals, you can still follow and see all of our public posts. That way, you can get direct information about uh, live streams or gameplays that we're doing or just regular videos. It's a good source for notifications. So give us a follow. Consider supporting us over there. Have a great day, and we will talk to you later.